channel it is day back in for the video for y'all and today if you have read that title we are going to be doing a unboxing for a camera that i bought for myself for my birthday so my birthday is in a couple of days november 4 ooh, 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 ooh. you're about to turn up so yeah my birthday is in a couple of days and every single year i buy myself something for my birthday now you know what i'm saying all throughout the year i buy myself whatever i want okay so for my birthday i wanted to buy myself a gift even though i get myself gifts all year round like it'd be my birthday all year round i'm a very treat yourself kind of girl and i think i deserve the world so i try to give myself the world but for my birthday i wanted to either get a designer bag because i don't have one i wanted to buy my very first designer bag or it was between buying a new laptop and a camera now, I never had a camera before and I never had a Mac before. So that was like what I wanted to do. I always think it's better to invest in yourself, like put money into investments over designer things. Also experiences. I will definitely pay for an experience over any type of designer item, you know, because you can't get that back. You know what I'm saying? When you die, you can't take these material things with you. But yeah, so as far as investments, I invested into a camera. I also invested into a laptop, but I'm actually beefing with Best Buy right now because they have been stringing me along, telling me that my computer was gonna be done at a certain time. And then they changed the time that it was gonna be done like a month later. And I was like, what? And then finally, like three days ago, I got this email saying that they completely canceled my order. Like, where's my laptop? Talking about a credit. So actually tomorrow I'm supposed to go up there speak to them kind of see like what's going on and why i can't get my computer my macbook computer and where is my money pretty much run me my coins if you ain't got my merchandise run me my coins so yeah so long story short i have the camera like i got the camera but the laptop is a, a problem you know what i'm saying that's a problem so going back to the camera i never had a camera i've always wanted a camera i've been filming on my iphone which nothing is wrong with that i find it a lot easier to pick up the phone and kind of record but it also gets very annoying i run two youtube channels which is this one day by day and i have a couples channel as well so as far as storage it's extremely hard i always run out of storage um as far as being out and you want to like snapchat and instagram and everything like that it's like oh i can't even switch to put something on my story because i'm recording with my phone as well so I'm kind of just fed up with it and I wanted to invest in a camera also like better quality or whatever but even though the iPhone has really really good quality so if you are recording with your iPhone and you don't really have money for a camera I would say stay with the iPhone like I absolutely love filming with my iPhone I think the quality is really good if you have you know the 11 Pro like it's it's top tier you know what I'm saying like it's it's fire so anyway I got a camera for those purposes just because I kind of got fed up with the whole um, sharing my phone, basically. Like, it's just a lot. So I decided to get this camera here, and this is the Sony ZV-1 camera. And as I was looking on the Best Buy website, it was between this and that G7, G7 whatever camera that everybody uses for um, blogs and stuff. Now, I seen this camera, and it said that it was voted like number one for content creators. And I was like, you know what? Like, I'm gonna get this camera. So um, I wound up getting this Sony camera. And actually, before I open it, I'm going to insert a video of me like open it for the very, very first time because I've already opened it. So that way, you guys can see what it looked like from my point of view when the box was first open. So I'm gonna insert that.
that I have the camera and obviously I opened it. I got it like three weeks ago. So I've opened it, played with it, all of that. And now I'm doing the review. Um, you open it and they have like instructions on top and everything, the manual, all of that. So next is in there, it comes with a charger. It comes with a wind, a wind blocker thing. I'm not sure what the correct term for that is. It is a accessory that you put on top of the camera to help you with the sound for like wind and things. And so this is my camera here. Hold it up for y'all. And this is the little wind thing that I told y'all about. It didn't come with it on there. I attached it already. And this is how it looks. Why is it like that? My boyfriend was playing with it, so wow. So yeah, it popped out immediately because my boyfriend left it on and now it's dead, but it came dead too. So you have to charge it immediately after you get it. And so the camera flips and you can flip it back and you can put it like that. And so, yeah. So that's kind of how it is. It's really, really cute, really, really small in my opinion. Um, I really, really like it, it's so pretty. And what I love the most about it obviously is that you can flip out the camera and kind of flip it so you can see and you can hold it this way and flip it back and it adjusts and it's just so cute, it's so cute. And it goes back just like that so this is the camera here so about this camera i guess because i'm not like a tech expert and i didn't know any better i didn't know that it didn't come with the sd card this camera does not come with the sd card this camera does not come with the sd card i don't know if that's all cameras but this camera didn't come with one i didn't know that so when i go up to best buy tomorrow to talk about them about my coins I probably will go ahead and get the SD card so that I can start using the camera because right now I'm still using my iPhone. But yeah, it didn't come with the SD card so I haven't been able to really like play with the um, audio and everything to see how it really is. Picture wise, I think it takes pictures beautifully but I also think, you know, like the iPhone takes pictures beautifully as well. So they're kind of neck and neck. I don't see any like big difference like, oh my God, it's so crystal clear. No, it takes good pictures. I think video wise, it focuses really well. Um, the zoom in and out is amazing. I like it. And it has like a lot of different features. This is my first camera. So I don't really know a lot about cameras, about like what all this stuff means. So I'm figuring it out as I go. Also on the bottom, it has this like latch right here. And this is where the SD will go in the battery. Now the battery comes with it and you have to insert it in it's not it doesn't come with it already in and then the memory card goes right there so that's that and you click it back and it locks also it comes with a charger this is the charger for it but it doesn't come with the block so you have to you know what i'm saying get a block for it to go on the wall or you can plug it up to your computer whatever you want to do you know what i'm saying so overall i mean i can't really rate this camera just being that i've never owned a camera but i just wanted to show y'all as far as um, my birthday gift like i just wanted to show you guys my birthday gift that i got for myself my new investment my new baby my new you know what i'm saying my first ever camera i just wanted to share that with y'all um as far as like on the tech side no i don't know what i'm talking about because i don't know nothing about cameras but as far as me sharing with y'all i absolutely love it i think it's so cute i think it could fit in my purse all of that all of that I'm very excited to use it. Um, I'm actually going on vacation in a couple of days and I don't think that I'm going to take it just because this is my new baby and if I lose it or get it messed up or whatever, I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be pissed. So I don't think I'm going to take it with me, but it's so cute. It's just so cute. Also, I want to show you guys on the side, they have a port right here for it, microphone. They have, um, this says multi, but this is where the charger goes. And they also have an HDMI um, little area too that you can just kind of click off. Yeah, so you see that. But yeah, I think it's super cute, super convenient. I could put this in my purse and whip it out 
I think the hardest part for me is going to be getting adjusted to the fact of you have to, you know what I'm saying, grab the camera and put on the camera because with an iPhone, you know what I'm saying, you always got your phone in your hand. So it's easy just to go to the, you know, video part and just start recording. This is the camera. You got to turn it on, get it focused, put it in the bright mode, all of that, all of that, all of that. So it's going to be very hard for me to adjust and get used to that. But yeah, this is just a super short video. If y'all can see what my um, birthday gift to myself was. Like, I'm so in love with it. It's just so cute to me. I wish I could have showed y'all my new computer, but that's a story for another time. Once I get done fighting with Best Buy, then I might come back and show y'all my computer. But yeah, this is it. I just love it so much. Like I can't, I just can't. It's so freaking cute to me. And I might get a bag for it, like a little, you know, sometimes they have like the little crossbody camera bags. I feel like I need something like that or some type of case or something, cause I'm clumsy. And that's why I can't have nice things. That's why. But yeah, this pretty much wraps up the video. I just want y'all to see my cute camera. This Again, this is the Sony ZV-1 camera. And I was going to get the G Mark G7. Y'all know what I'm talking about. The one that everybody use. Everybody use. But no, we got this one. So I can't wait to start using it. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. And make sure you turn that post notification bell on. So the next time that I drop a video, you don't know when, you'll be notified. I love you guys and thank you guys for watching.